The surname Accord comes from when the family resided at the court, a phrase which may have indicated either a large mansion or a tribunal. Some historians have suggested that certain variations of the name may be nicknames derived from the Old French and Old English word curt, meaning short or truncated. However, time has confused the different derivations, and it is now extremely difficult to tell which is appropriate to a given family or situation. A court from Ireland is an Anglo-Saxon name that originated in Covert or Court, Normandy, held by the service of one fee of the barony or Braos, Brews. William de Braus, Brews, first Lord of Bramber, died circa 1096, was granted extensive lands in Sussex by William the Conqueror. Accordingly, the Accord family held lands from him in Sussex. In 1107, William de Cuvert witnessed the foundation charter of Barnstaple and years later William Govert, Cuvert, held a fee of ancient enfeoffment from William de Courcy in Somerset. This surname may have several different spelling variations, such as the following. Emigration to Australia followed the first fleets of convicts, tradespeople, and early settlers. Early immigrants include Mr. John Accord, Accord, born in 1823, aged 14, English errand boy who was convicted in Dorset, England for life for stealing, transported aboard the Emma Eugenia on November 2, 1837, arriving in New South Wales, Australia. Emigration to New Zealand followed in the footsteps of the European explorers, such as Captain Cook, 1769 to 71st came sealers, whalers, missionaries, and traders. By 1838, the British New Zealand Company had begun buying land from the Maori tribes and selling it to settlers, and after the Treaty of Waitangi in 1840, many British families set out on the arduous six-month journey from Britain to Aotearoa to start a new life. The British first settled the British West Indies around 1604. They made many attempts but failed in some to establish settlements on the islands including St. Lucia and Grenada. By 1627 they had managed to establish settlements on St. Kitts, St. Christopher, and Barbados, but by 1641 the Spanish had moved in and destroyed some of these including those at Providence Island. The British continued to expand the settlements including setting the first federation in the British West Indies by 1674. Some of the islands include Barbados, Bermuda, Cayman Island, Turks and Caicos, Jamaica and Belize then known as British Honduras. By the 1960s many of the islands became independent after the West Indies Federation which existed from 1958 to 1962 failed due to internal political conflicts.